Hey there, Jay. Zero Pound Juggernauts here. Welcome to Fan Mail Money number 30. Now, what just happened yesterday was my brother destroyed my TV. And you can see the video here, and you could not see my TV right there. Um, there's a lot of confusion about what happened. Well, this is where I'll tell you. I won't do another video uh, about this, so you're getting it before Fan Mail starts. Um, we came up with a little prank on Jeffrey, uh, the diabolical plan. Me and Corn were going to film me destroying my already destroyed play button and make it look like it was my brother's. I sent that video to Jeffrey. He thought it was real, just like we wanted him to, just to piss him off. But as far as him destroying my TV, that was something I didn't, I didn't really account for. And that happened. Uh, you can find my uh, my side of the video right down here in the corner. Um, so this is actually my play button. This is what's left of it, guys. I won't be hanging this up. Honestly, I think I might turn it into a belt buckle. I think that'd be pretty badass. So this is what's left of it. But I guess it all won't really matter once we get the million uh, gold play button. So let's get started. We're going to kick off fan mail with the Jim and Dean breakfast bowl. Somebody actually sent me this um, me being a health conscious individual, I looked at the nutrition and this is 113% of your daily dose of cholesterol. So, uh, I hope this isn't a, I mean, the fact that this is a real food scares the living shit out of me. And there's just a note inside. Thank God there's no actual breakfast bowl. Dear Jesse, please keep in mind that Ella keeps eating all the toilet paper. What? Okay, glad I got your attention. You got it. I'm writing to let you know that I've been watching your videos closely. I'm a big fan of your dad and would like to see more of him. Are you kidding me? I am hoping that one day I will get to mow lawns with him. What? Is it possible that you can mail me one of your dad's dress shirts? It would be very much appreciated. I'm thinking I can refer more people to your channel. As a returning favor, check out my channel. I have some videos of myself. Hard smoking Maverick Red 100s. Hoping to put up more smoking vids soon. Oh my gosh. Parker Drake, you're a fan of my father? Oh. Alright, this is from Texas. Hopefully it's something big. Oh, uh, what do we got here? We got a note. Oh gosh, there's games in here. Don't send me freaking games! But thank you. My name is Brady. I live in Texas. I've been a Juggie since 300k subs. I hate your dad for all the things you destroyed that you worked really hard for. I've been wondering for a long time if you ever think about doing meetups. If you ever get the chance, come down to Dallas. At one point in time, in this, in this life, I will go and do a tour of some kind. Next summer, I must do it. Thank you so much. Oh, he's got some Eagle memes and some Master Chief memes. He sent me some games. Oh, this is really exciting. He sent me a little cow. Oh, it's a, it's a Chick-fil-A cow. Mmm. Mmm. Very nice. Oh, baby. I got a Movie Buff Award. Thank you, sir. That's some 360 stuff. Thank you, dude. Be rigid. Says, Hi, Jesse. My name's Cody. I've been a sub for a while now. Please put this on fan mail. I put an Xbox 360 controller in because I sold my Xbox to a friend and have no use for it. I also have a wolf that I made in a magazine. Give the little drawing to Uncle Larry. Oh, wow. That's really good. I think this is made out of masking tape and then painted. That's awesome. Good little Minecraft Steve. Oh, sorry. I just fucking ate lunch. Guinness Book of World Records. I wonder if we're in here. For most things destroyed by a father figure. What is this? Oh, this is a really sick. Good feeling Xbox 360 controller. Thanks, man. I appreciate it. But don't send me your electronics. <laughs> oh, here's the drawing. Larry's Lounge, Corona Extra. Very nice. Thanks, Cody. My Juggy Keisha, uh, really take the shit out of this box. I'm unable to open it. So, where there is no entry, you make your own. Dig my P.O. Box key into it. Ah, there we go. Penetrate the nature box and really loosen up the hole here. You guys gotta calm down with your tape, because that really discourages me from opening it, because I can't open it. Oh, married a car for the DS, good stuff. Oh, this is for Uncle Larry. Oh, you got it. it. Says, please don't send me this back. Give it to him on camera. Uncle Larry doesn't have a DS, uh, but I notice he has gaming on his channel now. This is for Juliet. 20% off coupon. Very nice. We do have some leftover Nature Box food. We have Halo 4, don't send me games. Oh, you didn't put the games in. You just gave it to me to put some of my loose discs. Oh, thank you. This is very nice. Oh, it's a legit cat treat for Garfunkel. And we got some stuff for boobs and Poop John. Oh, thanks Keisha or Keisha. 
You rock. Keep it rigid. Now this one's exciting because it's got the Christmas wrapping paper. <laughs> ah, there's a box of tape. Alright, alright, we can play this game. It's all you need. It's one tape seal covering the flaps. Me and my brother have some questions for you. Did you watch the NBA Finals? No. Who are you rooting for? No. <laughs> do you like Minecraft? Yes, I do. Minecraft is awesome. What would you like me to draw next? Uh, blah, 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 blah. In Eagle, where did you go when you were in L.A.? Uh, to the uh, L.A. Convention Center, and Beverly Hills, and all over the place. Drew a cow, drew some uh, dragons, some Minecraft stuff. Oh, you did draw an eagle. Never mind. I would like you to draw me then. This is awesome. Thank you so much, man. That's already it for the packages, Juggies. I mean, well, I guess this Illuminati-type wedge of cheese is a package. This is from Royal Mail. Par Avion. I believe it's from the UK. Let's see what we got here. If it's legitimately a block of cheese, I'd be really excited. No, it is a, uh, it's a little car. Interesting. It's a little model car. And that's it. Weird. What if there was something in the trunk of this car? Oh, it's not a car! It's a mouse! It's a freaking wireless mouse! Yeah, it's just all envelopes now. Get a, we have like 20 large envelopes, not so much packages, which that's fine. I'd say they're a lot easier to open. This is kind of heavy. It says mod in a box. Mod in a box? Like a, what does that mean? What is this? I'm scared. What the word? Whoa, this is like a like a toolkit to, to mod. Uh, oh sh! What on the world? Systema made it. What is this? Mod in a box. Two freaking cardboard chunks. What is this? It's like a little. I got some stuff. Thank you. Uh, I think his name is Taylor. Mod in a box. Keep it rigid, dude. What is this? What is this? So many things. I'm like, what is going on here? This is the strangest fan mail yet. Paper towel? What is in here? Oh, it's a cow with, with three legs. <laughs> Sorry, that this, the cow is injured. It says share a Coke with Jesse. Oh, thank you. Uh, here's the letter. Harrison, please give me some answers. What's going on with fan mail today? It's really freaky. There are a lot of things that I just don't know what they are. I'm scared, guys. Oh, okay, Harrison. Make me feel better. Make sure I love your vids. You are really good at making entertaining YouTube vids. You are my hero for putting up with your dad's sh boop every day. I love your vids. Please keep making them. I've been a loyal subscriber since 700k. Oh, thank you. Oh, it's a mouse pad. I've never seen one like this. Thank you so much, Harrison. Finally, things are making sense again. Inside here, we have a Trisonic cutter set. Is this legit? Or is this kid stuff? Oh no, this is real! These are actual handy tools. Dude, this is awesome. Who do I have to thank for these? It says, hey Jesse, my name is Colin, I'm 21 years old. Here's a pack of handy tools that will help you open future fan mail. Even an envelope opener in the set. It's been driving me insane that you aren't using a pair of scissors or a box cutter and you struggle to open boxes on your videos. Problem solved. I really enjoy watching your blogs. I look forward to them every day. People think your videos are fake have no sense of reality, by the way. Enjoy. That, thank you. I mean, I say this all the time. People come in the street, people say shit to me, and it's like... If what you're seeing is fake, that means my whole freaking life is fake. That means I don't exist. Do you understand what I'm saying here? I just, I'm not a real human. My life is... That doesn't... It's, it's a borderline offensive, juggies and non-juggies. Ah. But I digress. This is a big one. That's what she said. Let's see what we got here. It's been a while since I had a solid, that's what she said. But I feel like that was a gimme, you know? For, you know, you always get to that point where, where somebody says something and you're like, that's what she said. But it's almost like such an obvious, that's what she said, you don't say it. I feel like it's almost better to say it than not to ever. Because even though it may be obvious, it still might get a laugh because it was so obvious. Only the cursed survive. What is it supposed to be for? Jesse, it's Tabus, Tabus again. My real name is Tra- oh, Travis. But that's what everyone calls me. Remember I sent you the Walker plush? Yes. I live in Texas and watch your videos every day. This time I sent you a Black Ops 3 poster. Oh! 
P.S. Every time he gets chicken nuggets, I ask for McJagger nuggets. Dude, yes, keep doing that. That's so sick. And this is a Black Ops 3 poster? Oh, I had no idea. Dude, that's awesome. Thank you, man. All right, these are the last of the envelopes. Whoa, this looks like an old Superman comment. Is this worth a lot of money? <laughs> Hi Jesse, my name's Reed, I'm 14, I live in Chicago. I think you're a really cool guy, I know how tough life is sometimes for you, but I admire how you still stay positive about things. Anyway, thanks for taking the time to read this, keep it rigid, best regards, Reed. Thank you, dude. I guess, technically, I start using that tool set to open these things. Oh! There we go, nice little keep it rigid action. That's always nice to see. An eagle's landing, still to this day, being referenced, I miss it so. <sighs> I do miss those days. Dear Jesse, my name is Skylar. I'm a girl juggie. Oh, yeah! <laughs> I'm 13 years old. I've been watching you since Eagles Landing. My school mascot is an eagle. I'm from Chicago, and when I first started watching your videos, I thought they were fake. But as I kept watching, I knew they were real. I'm sorry for what your dad does to your things, and I hope your relationship with him gets better. The first video I watched of yours was when your brother's iPad got smashed by his girlfriend. Cha-ching! I think your brother's a jerk for filming things you don't want him to film. Oh, speak of the devil. I also think your dad is a jerk for smashing and ruining his stuff. I think it's amazing how us Juggies came together to make the Juggies Unite video. I still cannot thank you guys enough for that. That's why I'm in the house right now. I also subscribe to Juliet's. I think she's a really good singer. Thank you. I hope you can move out soon so you can be happier and really hope you're having a great summer. Well, I should be moved out by uh, January. That's not far. That's half a year. I have a few questions. Favorite color? Orange. Favorite food? Sushi. What hobbies do I like? Uh, video making and video games. How long have you and Julia been dating? Uh, a year and nine months. When did you start this channel? December of 2006. So almost nine years ago. Thanks sincerely, Skylar. Thank you, Skylar. Keep it rigid. I keep feeling something poking me in the ass. That sounds dirty. Ugh. My old television remote. Throw that in the garbage. Let's continue. Looks like Trooper True again. He always does. It's a very official envelope. Greetings, Major. It's Trooper True here. Enclosed in this rather large envelope are two letters. This one you can read out loud in your next fan mail. The second I would appreciate if it read in private, off camera, due to the personal stuff I have to share with you regarding my family. Very nice, man. I appreciate you sending me this. Got you. Also enclosed a personalized MJPL Brotherhood membership plaque for your lovely girlfriend, Juliet. Very nice. Uh, I personally think she should be your occasional co-host with Juggies Panel videos. I love how she adds her personal flair to your usual intro. Aw, thank you, Trooper True. That's it for now. I look forward to more entertaining videos from you. See you next time, and God bless. Goodbye for now. Keep it rigid as always, Trooper True. Thanks, Trooper True. You know, I'm waiting to see, I'm waiting to see some McJuggernuggets fan fiction. I, I always find them hilarious. Hi, Jesse. My name is John. I love your videos. My favorite... Poopy John? My favorite video of yours is the origin of McJuggernuggets. I started watching your videos a month ago, and I love them. Your live streams on Twitch are also amazing. Which reminds me, stream tomorrow, 7 p.m. Eastern, 2 midnight. I should be very on time. And also, I think I improved the video quality, and we're definitely getting that game audio in the mix. So we should have everything set. Should be exciting. You're my favorite YouTuber of all time, and when I watched your videos, Second Dad reacts 1 million subs, I knew he was going to let you back in. I wish I shared that confidence. <laughs> I found a funny pic of you online, so I sent it to you, taped to a piece of paper. Thanks, John. What do we got here? Oh, it's a McJournalist Pokemon card. Apparently his abilities are fighting, and that is done by destroying trophies, and then also bad words. The ability to say bad words. It does 200 damage, so I mean, that's pretty good. And it says McJournalists. Thanks, John. It says, please feature me on the envelope. Well, my friend, you are getting the star treatment. Read this. Jesse only. Don't worry, this ain't going to anybody else. Ringmaster's Haunted Castle, VIP Weekend Pass. This is in Hasbrook Heights, New Jersey. New Jersey, eh? Well, shit, this is four passes. Are these legitimate? My name is Adam. I've been watching your second series videos, and it sucks to see you go through this. So as a gift, I've decided to give you four free VIP passes to my show, Ringmaster's Haunted Castle. You can bring Juliet, Corn, your mom, Uncle Larry, or Tom. No second dad or brother. Gotcha. You may be wondering, Ringmaster, where have I heard that before? Well, you see, I sent you fan mail a couple weeks ago, but I'm unsure if you got it. I'm an extreme fan, and it will be an honor to have you and three guests at the show. Don't know about my show? Visit this website. Look forward to seeing you, and tell the Juggies where you're going to. The more, the scarier. Ha! I like that saying. Keep it rigid, man. This feels squishy, almost like t-shirt squishy. Oh! It is! Uh-oh, I see some tie-dye. Lots of colors happening. What is this? Let me read the letter first. It says, McJugger Nuggets from Bethany. Bethany, the mail sorter? Corn's sister? What can I say about a man named Corn? My name is Bethany. You already received mail from my brother Tavis. Oh, Travis, he sent you the Walking Dead toy. I would really appreciate his shout out from you. We love your channel and watch your vlogs daily. 
when they are uploaded. Sorry about all your games and whatnot being destroyed. From Bethany. Thank you. Thank you. And this says Eagles Landing with a very well drawn eagle. What do we have here? Oh my gosh, it's a stormtrooper laying out, sunbathing by the pool. Or in the pool! That's great! Thank you so much, Bethany and Travis. You guys are awesome. And this feels like a case, whether it's a game or DVD, I do not know. I guess it could also be like a Blu-ray. Whoa, what is this? What on earth? It's a McJuggernuggets DVD! And look at the back! It's like an actual movie! It says, McJuggernuggets is a story about a YouTuber, his fans, his friends, his family, and his defense against his psycho dad. Watch in awe as he goes through getting everything he owns destroyed by his father. Uh, celebrate his Uncle Larry brings him into his home for a simpler life. Experience true happiness as Jesse is finally allowed back in the house by, oh, we just spoiled the end. Whoops. <laughs> With quotes. Says, please just stop playing the games and get a proper... J yeah, it's, it's so sad. It's so, I like... It's almost funny because it's so sad and true. If you haven't seen McJuggernauts yet, you haven't lived, says Ad Shield. This is a juggy. Is there an actual DVD in here? Oh, no. Oh, but there's a letter. <laughs> Hi, Jesse. My name is Ad Shield. Pronounce A-D. Oh, awkward. Um, and you are a huge inspiration... <laughs> and you are a huge inspiration to me. I do YouTube videos, too. Uh, and it's mostly gaming stuff. I have a friend who is a diehard fan of your videos, and his Steam name is this. I'm also making a game called Five Nights at Legoland. Interesting. Um... You'll find my awfully drawn Master Chief helmet. I hope you enjoyed E3, and, oh, keep it rigid. Thanks, man. I appreciate this. This is nifty. I don't know how it happened, but we are somehow at everybody's favorite part, the lightning speed round. I don't, maybe we just have less mail this week, or there's just more letters and packages. I don't know, but I selected 21 letters at random. I'm going to read them as fast as possible while still covering everything and being just as happy-go-lucky as possible, even despite my TV getting destroyed yesterday. But it's okay. I'll get a new one. I'll pay my parents' bill. We're good. This is raw, uncut, unedited, great stuff. Jesse getting just wild, down and dirty with fan mail. I'm a journey. You might not remember me, but I was in fan mail 28. You're also going to hear me mess up so many times I'm trying to read so fast my tongue's that long. And I have some questions for you. One more thing. Can you please give my YouTube a shout out? Unhip Gnome 15. There you go, guys. Oh, and I'm from Australia, so this might take a while. <laughs> You're my, still my favorite YouTuber, not Stampy. He's my second. Yes! That's sick. Uh, number one, how does it feel to get your stuff broken all the time? I feel like I don't even need to answer that question. It sucks a big... Think of the worst thing you could possibly stick in your mouth and suck on. That's, that's how... It, it's horrible. And it's not... Okay, you didn't say my dad, but it is... Yeah, it's from my brother, too. Uh, when your dad buried you, did you pass out or what? That's a good question. Well, I had all that dirt poured on me. All I saw was blackness, not to mention it hurt. Luckily, it was the back of my head that really got covered because uh, my original brain injury was in the front. I had it happen there. We went a little different story. Um, but it hit me in the back. Everything went dark. I thought I got knocked out, but no, it was just, you know, there was so much dirt I couldn't see. And then I thought, you know what? If I pretended to be, like, I don't want to say killed, but if I pretended to be, like, unconscious or something, I thought maybe they would feel bad. But... Nah, didn't really seem like it. So after 10 seconds, and then I couldn't really breathe, so I, I came up. Um, but yeah, that's what happened. Thank you for asking, man. Keep it rigid. That's a good question. Hey, Juggy. I'm a Juggy? I guess I am a Juggy, aren't I? Hey, Juggy. Here writing a letter to Jesse with a few thoughts I hope you are able to share with your father. I've been through some similar stuff you have been going through. I completely understand your frustration to your father. Thank you. This is kind of cool. I once got my brand new flat screen TV smashed by my dad and it really pissed me off. Thank you. Because this is like, this is like a real thing that happens and people just don't seem to understand that. So they immediately assume that it's not real or that it's like, it's, it's beyond them, you know, it's, it's just, it doesn't really compute with some people because they haven't never lived a life like that. Um, I don't know if you're reading this or not, Jesse, but I think what you're doing is right. Thank you. In the real world, you have to stand up for what you believe in. That's exactly what you're doing. I understand 100% what you're going through, man. Jenny for life. P.S. Congrats on 1 million subs. I know I'm just one sub of your currently 1.3, but I hope you can give some feedback on your thoughts about this letter. Um, and who is this from? This is from Sam. Sam, thank you so much for that letter. I, there needs to be more people like you that really understand... Uh, this kind of issue, and I'm sorry to hear that you have to go through similar stuff. Dear Jesse, hi Jesse, I'm Jaden, and I'm 12 years old. I've been a Juggie since last summer. Wow. 
I really felt bad for you and your dad buried your game collection when your brother Jeffrey is always making fun of you. Yeah. There should be a fight with you and your bro called Majorga Nuggets vs. Big Brother. I don't think I would win. I do not want to cross that bridge. I hope I'm featured in FanMail 29 or 30. I like the E3 videos. I've always wanted to go to LA. You should make a comeback for everyday situations. I also hate everyone says the videos are fake. It's real. Sincerely, Jaden. Yeah, I feel your pain. And dude, you gotta get to LA. Uh, you're young. You have plenty of time. Get to LA. Get to E3. Find a way. You'll get there. Chansey and Gligar? I know Chansey. One of the original 151. This looks like a YouTube thingy. Dear Jesse, I hope you become rich someday. Me too. You are the best YouTuber ever from Keegan. Make sure to check out my YouTube channel called Keegan Schmidt. My name is Keegan. I'm 10 years old, live in Missouri. Very nice. Thanks, man. Keep it rigid. I wish you the best of luck with your YouTube channel. It's a lot of fun. It takes a lot of work, though. Just remember that. Rest in peace, Eagles Landing. Oh, you got a little red green there. Reminds me of Christmas. Hope this Christmas is going to be good this year. Not like last year. This looks like a familiar uh, font choice. Dear Majorness, my name is Cameron. I've sent a letter before. I remember this. And you are the only YouTuber that I have ever sent fan mail to. I've been subbed since 200k. You've inspired me to create my own YouTube channel. I even wrote you for my career essay project in school. I think that's what I remember you from. My channel name is The Native Miner 2, and I do gaming, vlogs, tech reviews, and skits. I have 15 subs right now and hope to reach 60 by the end of the summer. That's good. Baby steps. Yep, set them goals. That's awesome, dude. Uh, my friend ASF Baseball likes to watch your vids too. And he does the same things that I do. I think that your father said about the grill was uncalled for, rude, and selfish. I'm also going to 7th grade next year. I was wondering if you had any advice for me. Keep it rigid, Cameron. Thanks, Cameron. Uh, advice for 7th grade? Uh, have fun. 7th and 8th grade, it may seem like everything to you at the time, but 7th uh, and 8th grade don't really matter too much, unless you get a girl pregnant or something. Just be careful. Um, that's I feel like where you really learn about your sexuality, at least for a lot of people that were in uh, those grades with me. Not me. I was a late bloomer. <laughs> um, but yeah, enjoy yourself and just try not to put too much pressure on it because uh, it, it's it's not really that important compared to, say, high school and then college. Uh, so just enjoy yourself. Lots of friendships to be had. <laughs> I don't know. It's been a while. Hey Jesse, after many failed attempts at bad handwriting, or words not centered, I think this one will be actually decent. It is currently 4.30 in the morning, and I am writing fan mail. Wow! Dedicated! Why you ask? Because I just saw fan mail 29, and I saw my letter featured on Lightning Speed Round! Had to write you more! Uh, thank you for referencing Lightning Speed Round. <laughs> not sure if you remember, but I'm Michaela. I do remember, because I know how you color code everything. It's really cool. The girl druggie. Anyway, just a few questions. How long does it take you to clean up fan mail? Well, uh, judging by the looks of this batch, I'd say around 30 minutes, if that. I have to really categorize everything, um, set aside stuff I have to read, stuff I still have to open, look at, stuff like that. So I'd say 30 minutes. Uh, any future fan mails with Tom or Uncle Larry? Yes, definitely. I have to set that up someday. Um, can you draw well? <laughs> no, no. Favorite song or favorite genre of music? I don't really have a favorite song right now. It changes uh, regularly. But favorite genre of music? I'd say alternative, oldies classic rock. Um, I like pretty much all forms of music. There, I can see the good in all of it, um, but I'd say alternative. I was completely disgusted with your dad's reaction of you and Jeffrey's present, the grill, on Father's Day. You would think he would be more appreciative. Exactly. Just thought you should know we all voted on a school mascot and I voted for an eagle because of you. Aw, oh, Michaela, thank you so much for this letter. Keep it rigid. I just love the, how you do it with the colors. It's so very neat. I'm a big fan of you. Dear Jesse, McJerneys, my name is Connor, I've been a juggie for a few months now, and I'm sorry your dad destroyed other games and thinks you should never play video games. I know how you feel because I'm 14 and my dad thinks I'm too immature or something to play games like COD or GTA. Dude, that sucks, man. I was playing games like that when I was like, what, 10? Ugh. I will pray that your dad will understand you and that Jeffrey will leave you alone. My gamer tag is this. And I would appreciate it if you friended me on live. Keep it rigid. You're number one juggy, Connor. P.S. Why do you prefer Xbox or PlayStation? Um, honestly, I don't necessarily prefer it. I think they're both awesome consoles. It's just all my friends play on Xbox. And that's just what I've gotten used to. Granted, I will say I prefer the Xbox controller to PlayStations. It's just a better fit. My name is Ashton. I'm 14. I hope you can put this in Fan Mail Monday. This is my first Fan Mail and first goes to the best. Mm-hmm. I like that. <laughs> I played GTA 5 for Xbox 360 and the one. I hope we can be friends on Xbox. I wanted to know if we could play uh, my next stream. Oh, play next stream. Yeah. I was thinking of doing something on the stream where I play with subscribers on a certain day. You know, really uh, pay attention to those hardcore juggies in the stream and, and get a chance to like play some games together. That'd be sick. Thank you for this, man, man. Keep it rigid. 
It was funny when I say mailman. Uh, this picture, uh, this must be the Juggy, uh, doing some, what is that? Karate? Taekwondo? I guess we're about to find out, find out. I don't know what that was with. I'm sure it'll make sense in a second. Hi, Jesse. I'm Tori. Hope you get this. I'm a Juggy. Draw a lot, but love watching your vids more. Keep it up. Do I draw nice? Oh, I'm assuming that's a hand-drawn picture of you. Very nice. And I guess that was you doing karate? Made something for GF, too. Oh. These are like cool, kind of like anime-ish drawings. Sorry, I'm like keeping them to myself. <laughs> Jesse, you rule. Aw, oh, thanks, Tori. Keep it rigid. You got these little notes. Curious. Dear Jesse, my name is Katie. Uh, I'm from Michigan. I'm 20 years old, and I am a stay-at-home wife. You help fill up the empty time I have in my day, and I thank you for that. Cherish the time you get with your dad. I know how it feels to not have a dad. Oh, mine even ditched me on my wedding day. I've never wrote a letter like this before, but I hope it's in fan mail. Uh, it's amazing to see how many people you inspire. Hashtag girl juggy. <laughs> Katie. Oh. Katie, I'm sorry to hear that. Wow. That's kind of ridiculous to hear. Uh, but I really appreciate you reaching out. Um, oh, here we go. Dear Jesse, I'm 20 years old. My husband thinks I'm nuts for getting so into your videos. I share them to my sister all the time. I hope I get a shout out on fan on Monday to show everyone that you got my letter. Glad to see that there aren't as many Psycho Dad videos. Uh, me too. And thought you said your mom was going to be in more videos. Yeah, um, she's getting real busy because because she does manage the merchandise for me, the the shirts and stuff at her co at her uh, canvas company, and it's just hard because they're a very small place. Uh, girl, Jenny, thank you so much. Um, <laughs> Katie, uh, well, it looks like now you can uh, show your friends, family, your husband that like I respond to your mail, and I really appreciate it. You're not crazy for getting into the videos. That's awesome. Oh, that's my broken uh, play button. Psycho Dad Drowns X... Okay, this is uh, somebody drawing, uh, recreating what happened when my dad threw my Xbox in the pool. Yeah, thanks, man. Yeah. Uh, baby, probably... Oh, sorry. Probably you wondering who am I. My name is Nick. <laughs> I'm one of your fans from YouTube. I really like your YouTube videos, and you are my first favorite YouTuber. I'm a YouTuber as well. My YouTube is Nick Fleming. It would mean so much to me if you subbed to me. I really like that prank when you were in the uh, you were in the dark. The video was called Paintball Prank. Oh yeah, when me and Uncle Larry totally knew Jeffrey was coming at us, and we reversed the prank and got him covered in water, and we literally took out his camera lens. That was so freaking sick. Who threw that? Oh, Uncle Larry threw that. I was doing the hose. Dude, direct hit. Love that. I got him so pissed off. My name is Samantha. I'm 15 years old. I started watching your videos back in November and instantly became a huge fan. My birthday is July 2nd and would appreciate a birthday shout out. Ooh, that's in a, a few days. Well, have a great birthday, Samantha. I guess you're turning 16. Have a great time. Age 16? That's a good year. Enjoy. I love watching your daily vlogs and powwows, not just the psychos like everybody else. I'm your biggest fan. We'll continue to watch your content and support you as time goes on. That means the world. Also love watching your Twitch streams and Periscopes. Oh, very nice. Dropping the Periscopes in there. You're the best YouTuber and you will always continue to be my favorite. I feel bad for all your stuff that has been destroyed over your love of video games. I truly hope that you and your dad can make amends in the near future. I hope your brother stops instigating you constantly. I believe in you eventually moving out sometime in the near future. You have helped me to have a positive outlook on things no matter how bad they can be. If you believe in yourself and you can do anything you put your mind to, I really hope that you will continue to make content and I will always continue to be a Juggy for life. Keep up the great work, Jesse, from your Juggy, Samantha. Samantha, thank you so much. That was really well said at the end there. Lots of great points. You can do anything. And even when shit gets bad, there's still reasons to smile. But you just have to find them in your mind. Oh my gosh, Ella! Fan mail! Lightning speed round! I can't stop, even if you're loud! Hi, my journalists. I love your channel. I'm one of the oldest subscribers. Been with you since 1000. And I love Rule 19, Overachievers, and the game. Mmm. All those. Thank you for naming them. My favorite skit is Beach Bum. Ooh! Thanks for putting your subscribers first. I'm going to get Arkham Knight for you to play on stream. I enjoy your blogs and angry nerd bits. Don't give me any games, man, if that's what you mean. Thanks for doing everything, and remember to keep it rigid. I appreciate it, dude. You need to put your name on this. Yeah. That's like four people now in this family that didn't put their name. Don't you want to be acknowledged? Or maybe not. Jesse, I used to hate you, but... <laughs> what? But now I, was, I, now I like you. Okay, well, that's all that matters, right? And I want you to know that I was going to send you my Halo collection, but my mom won't let me. Well, that's good, because I don't want you to send that to me, although I would appreciate it. I was going to send my Halo Edition Xbox One. I own every one of your shirts and stuff. Keep it rigid, Juggies. Check out my channel, Jacob Overman. Thanks, dude. Jacob, you rock. Keep it rigid. This is a little, uh, kind of like a koozie, but this is a Corona Extra Poncho. I'm assuming this is for Uncle Larry. I'm going to keep this set it aside. 
Um, if you guys want to send Uncle Larry fan mail, you don't have to do it through me. Uh, if you go on a OH MY GOD, YOU'RE FUCKING ANNOYING! Sorry. <laughs> Anywho, well, I can't cut that out. Guess we're just gonna leave it. Dear Jesse, my name is Christian, and I- oh, what was I saying? Yes, Uncle Larry's channel, he's doing fan mail now. He has his own P.O. box, just make sure you check it out. If you check out his first fan mail video on his channel, you can see it in the description, and uh, you can send him stuff through there. Or you can send it through me, and then I can make a trip to Uncle Larry's. It could give me an excuse to go see him, so whatever you guys want. My name is Christian, and I'm a huge fan of your channel. I'm sorry your dad destroyed your stuff. I was very upset when he destroyed your play button because you can't be that in a store. Oh, because you can't get that in a store, and it's hard work. Exactly. No, that's, it's a priceless valuable. It's an award. You can't. You can't buy it. Anyways, here's a beer bottle cover for your Uncle Larry. We all know how much he likes Coronas. True that. Thanks, Christian. And you're from uh, Pennsylvania. Not far, dude. Got a few letters left. Go out with a bang. Dear Mr. No. He snuck through. A lot of you guys may not know who this is, but during the first, like, 15 weeks of fan mail, I receive a letter from somebody addressing my father. Ella, I will cut you! I won't. I just... It's a threat. Empty. Go... Dear Mr. Ridgeway, go to your son Jesse's room and look inside at his computer and look up youtube.com slash and watch the video of Jesse smashing your older son's play button. Since he smashed his play button because of the video games, take away his computer, his TV, his PS4, his Xbox, all his games, and all of his cameras, and smash his stuff into pieces. Burn them. That would be his punishment. Your subscriber, Super Mario Mike. Yeah! Yes. This is Super Mario Mike, everyone. He's been a long time hater, and he sends mail to my father trying to get him to destroy stuff. And uh, it's been a running gag where I just destroyed this letter in many ways as possible. I believe in one of the videos, I literally burned the letter on camera, and it almost catches fire to my whole room. <laughs> it's pretty ridiculous. I didn't think he was ever going to show his face again. So Mario Mike, bastard. Is it sad that I'm actually kind of delighted to see you again? I miss the, uh, the trolling. Because it always get added a little spice to each fan mail. But don't ever send me anything again. Okay. <laughs> hey, Jesse, my name is now. I'm 13 years old. I've been watching videos ever since you started the channel. One of my favorite... Okay. One of my favorite videos was Psycho Dad Reacts 1 Million Juggies. It was awesome payback in exposing him in front of your dad. I agree. By the way, one thing we actually have in common is that we're both Jersey dudes. I'll probably next time send you an actual item. Uh, you were actually my inspiration to making a YouTube channel, RetroBoy64, so I should thank you. Here's some questions. Do you know any of these YouTube channels? Uh, Boogie298, Hangar Grandpa, or Angry Video Game Nerd? I know all three, and I love them all. What was the first video game that your dad taught you to play? Um, I think it was Super Mario Bros. 3, Sonic the Hedgehog, or um, uh, something else. Was it? Oh, Toe Jam and Earl? Or there's this XBX, uh, or not X-Men game, sorry. Uh, officially, how many consoles do you have? Um, collectively, at least... Ten that include we have a lot of old consoles, um, but my just myself maybe like four different uh, consoles. What was the main reason for calling your channel McJuggernauts, dude? Check out the origin of McJuggernauts video that answers all your questions. And this was from uh, sorry, this was from Noah. Thanks, man. Keep virgin. Ooh, we got a little bit of color. Little bit of color. McJuggernauts from Leah or Lee, the uh, Lee A. Uh, Leah. It's Leah. Sorry, I'm borderline stupid. I love you. Oh, thank you, Leah. I love you too. Keep it rigid. Hey, Victorians. My name is Ivan. I'm only 10 years old. It's my first time sending fan mail. I've been watching your videos for a long time now. I like your videos every time I come home from my grandparents' house. I watch your videos. Dude, Ivan, that's sick. And that makes me happy to hear that. I, I always stress myself out because, like, I know how many of you guys really count on seeing a new video. And it's just like, I need to put something out. So if you guys ever see me bugging out, just like... That's just that's just how I'm gonna be because I, I really count on you guys for everything. I know you count on me, so I just try my best to get a video of you guys out daily. And uh, sometimes it's hard, but just know I'm looking out for you guys. Dear Jesse, I'm one of your biggest juggies. I watch all your videos too. I wanted to know if your dad is really that mean. He's he uh, trust me, trust me. He's pretty bad, but um. He wasn't always like that. We used to get along. Uh, you can find old videos on my channel. He used to help me out with stuff, but ever since I graduated from college, that's when things started getting intense and uh, things have gotten progressively worse, I guess you could say. Will they get 
even worser? I don't know. Um, I don't know. One of my favorite videos is when you made Eagles Landing and when your friends came and saw you with the dead rabbit costume on. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I forgot. I had that Dying Darko bunny costume on to keep warm. How was E3? It was pretty sick. Uh, my name is Carmen. You can also find me on Instagram. Uh, can you, or it's Carmine, right? It's really Juggy Carmine. That reminds me of Gears of War, Carmine. It's the first time I heard that name. Guys, thank you so much for all the fan mail. I really appreciate it. If you guys are looking to send me fan mail, you can find that address in the description below. Just make any letters, packages, envelopes out to that, and uh, hopefully you'll get featured next next Monday. Uh, I will be going on vacation soon for a week to North Carolina, um, and that's going to be a big family thing. I, I don't know when exactly that is, so I maybe got like one to two more weeks left of fan mail before I go on a little break. Uh, I'll still be making videos for you guys. Keep me updated. Make sure you follow me on Twitter, Instagram. Links in the description below. We got the Twitch stream tomorrow night. That's down there as well. Don't forget to subscribe for more content. I love you, Jaggies to Death. This has been an awesome fan mail. And yeah, uh, I'm excited for the stream tomorrow. And got a new video coming out tomorrow. Don't know what it is yet, but we'll put together something nice. Let me know in the comments below if you guys enjoying the uh, the skits. Say like a man named Corn. Would you want to see more stuff like that? Let me know in the comments. I love you, Jaggies to Death. And don't forget to keep it rigid. Oh, P.S., we also have the Etsy shop in the description below. We have a lot of cool stuff on sale. Tank tops, uh, bracelets, uh, t-shirts, you name it. We got some coffee mugs, even hats. Check it out.